So, okay. So, good morning, everyone, grade 5 students. How are you? So, today's topic is all about physical changes. So, for me, what is physical changes? Okay, physical changes is like this one. For example, you can see this one is uh, an ice, right? And it will become water, okay? And then this one is an ice cream. And then it melts and become liquid, okay? So, first one, everybody, say physical changes. Physical changes. Now, can you spell physical changes? One, two, three. P H Y S I C A L changes C H A N G E S. Okay, very good. Physical changes. Physical changes. Okay. So let's go to the meaning of physical changes. So everybody read first one. When we say physical changes, the size, shape, color, and states of matter of substance may change. Size, can you spell size? S-I-Z-E or Z-E. Now spell shape. S H A P and E spell color C O L O R and the states of matter. Can you spell states? One, two, three. S T A T E S of O F and the matter M A double T or T. T E R. So first one. Let's start with size. Now, can you spell size? S I Z or Z E. Very good. Size. Now spell shape. S H A P E. Shape. Very good. Next, spell color. C O L O R. And then this one, the fourth one, you need to, you don't need to spell out, just say it. States of matter. Ready? One, two, three. States of matter. Very good. Now, let's try to answer this one. What is physical changes? One, two, three. The size, shape, color, and states of matter of substance may Change. Okay, very good. How about you again? One, two, three. Physical changes. The size, shape, color, and states of matter of substance may change. Very good. Next, so let's go. This one. So everybody read first one. Solid into liquid. Solid into liquid. So first, can you spell solid? S-O-L-I-D. Very good. Next, can you spell liquid? L-I-Q-U-I-D. Liquid. Very good. So again, read solid into liquid so this one is this one is the best example of this um, solid into liquid so the first one as you can see they have an ice and then the ice will become water so what physical changes is it it is a very good melting or fusion eh? now again Melting or fusion. Read. One, two, three. Melting or fusion. Very good. Now, first, can you spell melting? Start with letter M. E. L. T. I. N. G. And then, or fusion. How about fusion? Can you spell fusion? Start with letter F. Very good. F. U. S. I 
O N. Fusion. Very good, no? When we say melting, this is the best example. An ice when become or will become a water. Very good. Yeah? So remember that this process or these physical changes is what we call melting. Melting is solid into liquid. Very good. Next. Number two, we have mm, this one. Uh, liquid into solid. What is the best example for that? This one, huh? Liquid into sol solid. First, can you spell liquid again? Start with letter. Very good. L-I-Q-U-I-D. And then solid. S-O-L-I-D. Very good. This process or physical changes is what we call very good. Freezing or solidification. Again, can you read? Solidification. Again, one, two, three. Solidification. Yeah? This one is freezing or solidification. Read? One, two, three. Freezing or solidification. Very good. Now first, can you spell freezing? Start with letter F. Very good. F, R, E, or double E, Z, or Z, I, N, G. Freezing. Very good. Next, how about can you spell solidification? Hmm? Start with letter S. Very good. So, S, O, L, I, D, I, F, I, C, A, T, I, O, N. Solidification. Again, solidification. Very good. So, the best example for this is an ice, oh, an, uh, a water will become an ice. Uh, unlike for the melting, melting is ice will become water, right? This one, water will become ice. Very good. So, the liquid is the water and the solid is the ice. Very good. Did you understand? Okay. So, next, let's go to the third physical changes. We have mm, this one. As you can see now. What? Can you see that? Oh, okay. What is it? It is a water which is boiling, right? So everybody first read the meaning. It boils, change into gas. Again, one, two, three. It boils, change into gas. The red one will you be, uh, remember, change into gas. This physical changes or process is what we call Boiling or vaporization. Again, vaporization. Huh? Again, one, two, three. Vaporization. Understand? Very good. Now, first, can you spell boiling? And it starts with letter. Very good. B. B O I L I N G. Boiling. Next, vaporization. Now, start with letter V. Very good. So, V A P O R I Z or Z A T I O N. Vaporization. Very good. So, when you say boiling, it is a um, water or the water will become gas. Huh? So it, it's, it's just the uh, same with evaporation, but this one it uh, is an actual process for changes into gas, okay? It's an actual changes into gas, okay? That is example, that the water and then the heat, it will be heated or heated by the pan. Hmm? So understand? This is the example now. Next, 
Number four. Next, physical changes or process is this one. The meaning is liquid into gas. Yeah, as, I said, as I said earlier, uh, it's, it's something like boiling, but this is the best uh, good example for the liquid into gas. Okay. So first, can you spell liquid? L-I-Q-Q-I-D. And then the gas? G-A-S. Very good. So liquid, the uh, example is water. And then gas, the liquid will uh, evaporate like that, going up. What do you call that? I said that we uh, start with letter E. Okay, very good. So everybody read evaporation. Hmm? Evaporation. Everybody read evaporation. Now, can you spell evaporation? And it starts with letter E. E V A P O R A T. I O N. Evaporation again. Can you spell evaporation? Start with letter E V A P O R I T I O N. Very good. Evaporation. Okay. Next. This one, understand? Evaporation, uh, water become gas or going to air. Okay? Next. This one, look at the clip or the art. Mm. As you can see, there's a moist or what we call the gas and then change into water or liquid. So the meaning is the gas into liquid. So what is it? This process or physical changes is what we call condensation. Very good. Condensation is gas into liquid. That is the best example. As you can see, the gas is what we call the moist. The moist in the window. And then the girl or the lady will try to wipe it out. And it will become the water will flow into the window. And that's what we call condensation. Another example is this one. As you can see, this is the coffee with ice. The condensation is this one, okay? The moist is the gas, and then I try to wipe it out, and then the liquid will become the water, okay? So, this process or physical changes is what we call condensation, okay? Understand? Condensation. Now, let's try to spell out. Start with letter C. C-O-N-D-E-N-S-A-T-I-O-N. -E Condensation. Very good. Again, let's tr try to cover up. Oh, sorry. Again, one, two, three. C -O -N, C-O-N, D-E-N. And then S A C and T I O N condensation. Okay, when we say condensation, gas into liquid. Okay, as I give you an example, the moist in uh, my coffee, and then when I try to wipe it out, it will become the water into liquid. Okay, understand? Remember, gas into liquid. Okay. Gas, our example is an air. Liquid, example is a water, or juice, or coffee, okay? Understand? Next, physical changes we have. This one, what you call that? As you can see in the art, mm -hmm, the air will become ice, or the gas become into solid. So what physical changes is it? Let's try to find out. Is it? Okay. Deposition. Everybody read? Deposition. Very good. Now, the best example is that the air will become ice. For example, is the snow, as you can see. 
Now, gas into solid. First one. This process is what we call deposition or this physical changes is what we call deposition. Okay? Now, let's try to spell out deposition. One, two, three. D, E, P, O, S, I, T, I, O, N. Deposition. Very good. Okay? Next one. Let's try to cover up. Oh, sorry. Cover up. Okay, now spell. One, two, three. D, E, P, O, S, I, T, I, O, N. The position. Very good. Okay? Understand, huh? Remember, the position is gas into liquid. Uh -huh. Sorry, gas into solid, okay? Unlike condensation is gas into liquid, okay? And then the last physical changes that we have is, okay, everybody read reversible. Reversible. Reversible, okay? Reversible. When we say reversible, it is a can be changed back. It means... Let's look for the example. This one, as you can see, we have the water will become ice. And then this uh, the other picture, ice will become water. So it's like a uh, change back, okay? Back by its uh, physical. Example, this one, uh, again, the water will become ice and then the ice will become water. So it can be changed back. This process or physical changes is what we call reversible or reversible, okay? Now, let's try to spell out reversible. Start with letter R. R-E-V-E-R-S-I-B-L-E. -E -E. Reversible. Very good. So, I want you to get a piece of paper and pen. Okay, again, paper and pen because we have a quiz. Okay, ready, ready? Get paper and pen. Okay, now ready? And then write one up to seven. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Okay. So, first one, now, are you ready? Let's start with number one. And then, after that question, I will count one to five, and then I will switch to another question, okay? Are you ready? Get paper and pen, eh? and then write one up to seven. Understand? Okay, ready? Let's start with number one. Number one question is, can be changed back. Can be changed back. Okay. We'll count now. Five, four, three, two, and one. Okay. Time's up. Next number two. Gas into solid. Gas into solid. We'll count. Five, four, three, two. Okay, again. Five, four, three, two, and one. Okay, next number. Three. Whoops, whoops, whoops. Number three. Okay, gas into liquid, gas into liquid, okay, as you can see, there is a moist or there is a gas, and then the lady wipe out, it will become flowing water, gas into liquid, I will count now, five, 
four, three, two, one. Okay, time's up. Next number, four. Whoops, yeah. Number four, okay. <laughs> so the question is, it is liquid into gas. I think you saw the answer, but it's okay. Liquid into gas. Sample that is the water will become uh, up to going to the air. Liquid into gas. Okay. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Okay. Next. Okay. This one. Oh, no, no, no. This one. Okay. Okay. This one, change into gas. Change into gas, okay? So as you can see, there's a water and then it's boil, boils. There's an example that boils. It boils, change into gas. Five, four, Three, two, one. Okay, next. Number six. This one. Oh, number six. Liquid into solid. So, as I said earlier, sample, water will become ice. That is the best example. Liquid into solid. Okay? What kind of physical change is it? Liquid into solid or water become ice. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay. And then the last one, number seven. We have all that number seven. This one, solid into liquid. Okay, the solid is the ice and then the liquid, the water. As you can see, there's an example. The ice will become melt. Uh, I already said the answer. So, what uh, kind of physical changes is it? Count now. Five, four. Three, two, one. Okay, time's up. So let's check your answer. If you're correct now. Okay, let's start with number one. Number one is reversible. Okay, so start with letter R E V E R S I B L E. Reversible. Very good. Okay, next number. Two, okay, deposition, deposition. Start with letter D, E, P, O, S, I, T, I, O, N. Deposition, very good. And then the last one, uh, next number, three, very good. Condensation, condensation. Start with letter C, O, N, D, E, N. S-A-T-I-O-N. Very good. Next, number four, we have evaporation. Okay, evaporation. Start with letter E and then V-A-P-O-R-A-T-I-O-N. Evaporation. Okay, next number, five. Uh, boiling, I'm um, sorry, Boiling or vaporization. Boiling or vaporization. Okay, so boiling start with letter B and O I L I N G. Uh, is it okay that you can answer boiling? Okay, or vaporization? Okay, you can uh, answer boiling only. It's okay, or vaporization? It's okay. Okay, so boiling start with letter B O I L I N G. And then vaporization, 
V A P O R R I Z or Z A T I O N. Okay. Next number is six freezing. Very good. Start with uh, freezing or solidification. You can answer freezing. It's okay. Solidification. It's okay. Okay. Understand? So freezing spell start with letter F, then R, double E or E E Z Z or Z I N G. Okay. And then solidification. S O L I D I F I C A T I O N. Okay. Solidification. And then the last one, the number seven, we have very good melting or fusion. You can answer melting only or fusion only. Okay. So melting starts with letter M E L T I N G. Melting or fusion. F U S I O N. Okay. Very good. So count the correct number. I'll count the correct answer. And then. I hope you enjoyed this uh, science class. And then see you next time. See you around. Goodbye.